University in Fairfield, Connecticut. It's the 2015 Colonial Athletic Conference Men's Lacrosse Championship. Jenner to Conan, back up top. Joe Sider, number 26, player we'll be talking about all afternoon. Rips it for the goal. Towson's on the board. Drawing slides. Here he has a short stick. Let's see if he can take advantage of it. Drenner, finding a cutter, Max is in, and a goal for Towson. Drenner on the assist. And a 2 0 lead. Ryan Drenner with a career day. Goal and four assists on the afternoon. A season high effort by Justin Mabus, and another goal by Towson. 3 0 here early. Keep some pressure on this Towson defense. If not, Tyler White will continue to gain some confidence. Shot kept low. And first goal of the game for UMass. Dan Mullet. And it takes a lot of discipline and practice as well, so. Here's Haggerty. <laughs> he finds the top corner, and it's a 3-2 game. Shot rip low, and wow, what a way to come back. Joe Sider with his second. Townsend women's team will be taking on James Madison on Sunday down in Delaware for the CAA Women's Championship game. Quick shot and a nice job by Towson up five to two. Solid recovery there by Towson. Patience on the offense are the Minutemen trying to work the ball around. This has been their best movement of the ball and they come away with the goal. Grant Whiteway with it and a 5-3 game. St. Laurent to Haggerty. And he scores. You were looking for the cutter. <laughs> yeah. They've scored on, on both their six on six possessions so far. Here's Andrew Sokol trying to work through the middle, and he does. Sokol knocks the game up at five. He must not focused in. There were some faux pas on, on balls that were errant turnovers, and Towson took advantage of it, but look what's happening here. The UMass Minutemen have become roaring back. Shot clock in effect. Wow. Ryan Drenner's shot. Rings the pipe, finds the goal. Under 15 to go now. And a shot and a goal out of the timeout. Cuginello, his second of the game. Cider. Try to work up the pass. And Joe Cider finds the far post. Towson with a two goal cushion once again. See how quickly UMass gets into trying to attack Tyler White. And there it is! <laughs> On the cue. Dan Muller said, I could do this, and puts his team within one with 8.24 to go. They bring Haggerty up front now. With the ball, quick movement by UMass. Trying to take advantage of being a player up, and they do! Great look. Gianni Biakin with the goal. And the Minutemen tied back up. And Max looking for a call as he tries to get back into position. Loose ball up in front. Back to UMass. Still loose on the ground. Oh! And lifted for the goal. Guess who? Justin Mavis. Somehow came out of the pack with that ball. Marion to feed with the ball. Haggerty oh. and 
tipped away by White. 2.5. Gotta check sticks now if you're Towson. Gotta feed it. Shot is good. And Towson wins the 2015 CAA Men's Lacrosse Championship. Uh, you know, Tyler's, Tyler's been terrific for us all year and um, you know a huge credit to UMass and, and the way they just kept the pressure on us. Um, they're a tremendous team and they showed that today from start to finish, uh, put us against the wall in the second half, but Tyler's been, been key for us all year, really uh, um, the main part of why we've been successful uh, throughout the season. So uh, Tyler stepped up big when it counted. Yeah, I mean, you can't script those. You, you know how that goes, and um, you'll, you'll take a goal any way you can. Offensively, I thought we really played uh, you know, pretty well for the most part today, and then we left a lot of goals on the field, whether it be pipes or um, you know, a credit to uh, uh, their goalie, Oliveri. He, he was tremendous. I thought we had a lot of really, really nice looks, and he just played phenomenal, kept them in the game, I thought, for, for the most part, with a lot of um, opportunities for us that he took away. And um, you know, our, our offense just stayed poised and stayed with the fight at the end. Huge possession there with uh, three minutes left, and you know, we'll take a horseshoe whenever we can. Uh, you know, first off, we're we're really excited to be there. You know, it's a team that you know didn't finish the season the way we wanted to with two losses in the regular season, bounced back in this tournament, and then put ourselves in position to, to win here today for the CAA championship and put us in the NCAA tournament. These guys have have worked hard all year. Um, you know, and. Hopefully we'll be able to enjoy this, but also get back to work um, regardless of uh, where we get put. And you know, we're excited for whoever we get to match up against and, and looking to, to move, this, uh, move this train forward. And you know, these guys are excited.